Prince Harry had his family back in California on his mind as he returned to the UK for a special event, the Well Child Awards. The Duke of Sussex, 38, stepped out at the annual event in London on Thursday. Prince Harry has been a patron of Well Child, a charity that supports seriously ill children and their families, since 2007 and is a regular at their awards ceremonies. Meghan Markle joined him at the event in 2018 and 2019. After presenting the award for Inspirational Child, aged 4 to 6, to Violet Seymour, Prince Harry gave a speech to the attendees where he spoke about the joys and challenges that come with parenting. Harry described himself as a father of two, referring to son Prince Archie, four, and daughter Princess Lilibet, two, and three dogs, so basically five souls. In addition to Meghan Spiegel named Guy who she had before meeting Prince Harry, the couple have also welcomed a black Labrador named Pula and another beagle named Mamma Mia into the family. Prince Harry continued that he was acutely aware of the joys and challenges that come with parenting, and that's with kids who aren't facing health challenges. To the parent carers in this room, you have my sincerest admiration and respect, he added. The level of support and responsibility you share daily is unrivaled and without fail. You deserve all the assistance that you need. Prince Harry previously counted himself as a dad to humans and pets alike. In the Netflix series Heart of Invictus, which premiered last week, he introduced himself by saying, My name's Harry. On any given day, I'm a dad of two under three-year-olds, got a couple of dogs, I'm, a husband, I'm founding patron of Invictus Games Foundation. There's lots of hats one wears, but I believe today is all about Invictus. The words he chose to utter have exposed a carefully concealed truth. Harry offered us a glimpse into his conversations with young Archie about his future aspirations. But hold on tight because what he said next is nothing short of astonishing. Harry's words shone a spotlight on a hidden corner of their lives. He was quoted saying, When I talk to my son Archie about what he wants to be when he grows up, I don't see any future, nor do I think about it because there's nothing. Did you catch that? There's nothing. The statement has sent shockwaves through royal enthusiasts and has finally brought to light what many have suspected all along. Henry's statement about said Archie shows that they don't have any children. Archie a phantom child, a mere illusion in the grand narrative of the royal family. What decent father would say that about his child? Henry's delusional believing that he has any children at all. A true fat were wooked be bringing his children along to see how other children live. His mother Diana took both boys with her for them to see how other people lived. Shane Henry hasn't picked up his mother's baton and is showing his children about how people succeed in life. The real life, not a privileged life like Henry had. The chilling truth is that there appears to be more to this story than meets the eye. We've all been captivated by the fairy tale of the Harkle family. But now, with these words spoken by Harry himself, that enchantment seems to be fading away. During the Queen's Jubilee Harry and Meghan flew to the UK without their children they were not on the private flight either way. Harry claims to have had a birthday party for Archie at Frogmore Cottage but no one came. Then the Montecito birthday party for Lily when no one came. Oprah admitted that in her visits to Montecito she never saw the children and James Corden admitted then when his family visited them at Montecito Palace he had not actually seen either child. Harry is blonde and ginger and Lily is available in blonde brunette, and ginger. 